Houston Station on Space to Ground. Welcome to Space to Ground, your weekly look at what's happening on board the ISS. I'm Nicole Cloutier Lamasters. Three members of the ISS crew are preparing for the end of their mission. Rick Mastracchio, Koichi Wakata, and Mikhail Turin return to Earth Tuesday. They've been preparing this week by performing descent drills and checkouts of their Soyuz spacecraft and entry suits. You can watch the landing this Tuesday night live on NASA TV or streaming on the internet. Meanwhile, on the ground, the next crew is preparing for their launch to space. Astronaut Reed Wiseman, Maxim Sureyev, and Alexander Gerst have been busy with final mission preparations and this week completed their final qualification exams. The three launch May 28th to join Steve Swanson, Alexander Skortov, and Oleg Artemyev for their long-duration stay. As part of the crew's science work this week, they set up a new garden in space. Veggie is a plant growth chamber that will be used on station to study the growth and development of lettuce seedlings in space. The hope is Veggie will be a resource for crew food growth and consumption. The system may also help improve crop production on Earth. And lettuce won't be the only thing growing in space. Nearly 800 lentil seeds will also be studied closely to see how they react to simulated gravity in space. The seeds were flown up as part of the Gravity 2 experiment that Rick Mastracchio set up this week. Using varied centrifuge speeds, researchers will assess how well the seedlings grow. This will not only help with developing the lentils as a potential food source, but also improve our knowledge of this important crop on Earth. We love getting your questions and comments. We also love to see your pictures of the ISS flying over your hometown. You can share them using hashtag spot the station. This picture came to us from Ian Smith in Connecticut. To find out how you can spot the station in the night sky, go to spotthestation.nasa.gov or try our Spot the Station app. Make sure to keep sending us your questions using hashtag space to ground. We'll see you next week.